Now, I know the title of this video says Harley, but we got to start here with this 89 ZX-10. I bought this bike in March of 2023, and I traded it in on the Harley in April. Love about the from speed and style. Hey, boy, millions. I swear, I head down here around, huh? Check out the old school, 1989. And then check out the new school, 2022. Same bike, 30 something years old. I mean, 30 something years later. Old school ZX10, new school ZX10. Tell me what y'all think about it. You see the color scheme, it's, it's, it's the same. He, he seemed to think his is faster than mine. But look at, don't that look meaner than that right there? This look like, this look like, I don't know. I don't know, man. Y'all tell me what y'all think about it. New school ZX10 versus the old school ZX10. He all stuck. I'm stuck with a pipe. What what y'all think? What y'all think? That's why the word life is on the end. You're gonna do it for life. And if anybody think bike life bullshit, they not living. This right here, this is a sport though. This is a sport. This ain't this ain't got no bad stuff to it. But everybody here family. And when we all form together, we form like Voltron, and we definitely run the streets. I do this shit because it's my passion, man. That's what I love to do. I do this shit every day. But you got to fall to know what not to do and what to do. You know what I'm saying? You got a dedication and hard work. So don't get in it just because you think you're going to get a little popular name off of it. You're going to get some girls and all that. Because that don't make you bite like this. Man, ride your own ride. That's all I can say. You try to ride like somebody else or do what other people do. You don't know what the fuck you're going through. So that was the ZX10 89 model. Plenty fast, even though the clutch was slipping. That's why I didn't race the uh, new school 2022. Don't ask me why, but I traded it in. Yeah, no. yeah, that's Some red heart pipes on it. That's a road king. That what that is? Yeah, road, road king. king. Yes, sir. All right, king. I ain't gonna drink nothing but crown. Yeah. Now on. Um, need some turn signals in the front. It look like he has some light, little light kit on there somewhere. Put me some music on it. Yeah, the paint is killing though. That paint is killing. A little fender bender. I ain't worried about that. Put me a 21 on the front. Yeah, that shit cold though. Is it still? Mm -hmm. All the dangerous. 25,000. Ain't that. Yeah, so this was my first day pulling off the lot. Took it home and looked at it without the bags, but I decided to go ahead and keep them on. But this is my first round of modifications. Added the highway pegs, the uh, chrome wind deflectors, and the uh, chin spoiler. And I got lights on that bitch now. Stay tuned for around uh, where the rest of it. Introducing Naomi.
Yeah, I think she likes it. So does my son, Thrill. But he doesn't like the rain. We're gonna wait for this. Uh, we're gonna wait for this rain to pass. So we're gonna keep riding. When I went, when I said I wanted to go to the pool. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be going to the pool today. But we out here, down here, right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. That was the insurance for. And I have me a new one. So this part is a reminder to watch your words and be careful what you say because that very same night, I wrecked my bike. I tried to ride it upside down and I found out that Harleys don't operate that way. So let's keep them shiny side up. Wear your helmet. All right, so they done took the bandage off. Oh, that ain't that bad. I just got a big ass gash on my forehead. That ain't that bad. Probably some some scarring up there because I can feel it. A little road rash. My knee hurt and my left ankle hurt like a mug. Like, but oh, and my fucking chest, like my rib rib tapes. Left, left side. Mm. But anyway, at any rate, we out here, down here, right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Willie Millions out here, down here, around right here. Public service announcement. Public safety announcement. If you ride a motorcycle, wear a helmet. Don't be stupid like me. Right, peace. Common sense and safety go together like ham and eggs. Carelessness and negligence eventually land you in the hospital or the morgue, and you're a long time dead. Just use your head, man. Use your head. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we are out here down here, around here about three months later, almost three months later. Um... <clears throat> The update on the Harley is that um ended up opting to fix it myself and not going with the insurance claim for a couple of different reasons. We'll get into that if if you want to. We'll talk about that later. But um <clears throat> I'm gonna give you a peek of what I got going on for right now with it. Um it's right here in front of me. Um not total, still runs. Um, I actually need a fuel pump for it, but other than that, I'm going to show you what I got. I got some more upgrades coming. I'm um, going to just give you a little little sneak peek, if you will. Um, matter of fact, and I'm going to, matter of fact, let me take this off. And then I'll show you, uh, matter of fact, I'll leave that on. And I'm going to show you the next project uh, that I'm working on something similar to my heartbreaker project um if y'all remember that my last my last motorcycle with the iron man i'm doing something real real similar with, with another katana so stay tuned for that so i'm gonna just i ain't gonna flip the camera around and cut it off and then bam bam but here's i'm gonna show you a little bit of the harley and the next uh my next project all right here you go you know same bike let me uh this is the only thing I'm gonna really show you. I did a little something different in the back. Um, as you can see, I put the 
I took the uh them them ugly yellow bulbs off the back and um and did the LED strips. Then I did the chrome um cover for this. Uh and the LEDs are switchbacks, so you know what I'm saying. I got an issue with my right side, but I figure that out later. Anyway, like I said, I ain't gonna show y'all too much more, but I'll give you a hint. Something different here, something different here, and something different here. That's all I'm gonna, as far as we're gonna go with that, okay? Okay, so here we go with the uh, katana. As you can see, I got the swing arm off. And um, I have a 08 race tail on there. You know, no lights, it's a race tail. You know how I do. Uh, I already got the seat cut pretty much. It's rubbing in here. It's rubbing, but I ain't really worried about it because you can't see it once the seat's on, but you know. Uh, 750 motor, nothing really major. Ain't did no work to the motor. It's, it is um, jetted. And um, as far as uh, pipe work, that's the muffler that I have right now, but I'm trying to get this Yoshi uh, off of eBay. I see this Yoshi that I want. It's already been cut. and uh, But it needs a little bit of work, but I want it because it's, it's perfect for what I want to do. So I might get that Yoshi and slap a bone there. If not, I'm gonna use that exhaust. Um, you see the color, it's gonna be this color. Uh, let's see, can I see my phone mount? Nice little phone mount right there. Put your phone in there like that, it snaps down. Take it out like that, put the phone in, boom. Uh, <clears throat> it's my gauge. You know what I'm saying? Got all the colors. All that. Whoop, whoop. <clears throat> so yeah, that's that project. Um I don't think I want to show you nothing else, man. So with that being said, I appreciate y'all watching my videos, man. Stay tuned because both of these bikes are gonna be out probably be pr probably within the next couple of weeks to the end of the month. It's October now, so by the end of October, both of these bikes should be back out on the streets. So stay tuned for another video or two. Like I said, appreciate y'all watching. Stay tuned. We out here down here, around here. All right, peace.